In this video, I'm going to show you how to send files privately using the Onion Share app. It works right from your phone, and because it runs over Tor, nobody in the middle can spy on what you're sharing. I'll also demo how I'm running it all through a cloud computer so my ISP can't see what I'm doing. So if you're tired of apps spying on you and what you share, this tool is for you. The best part about this, the app is free and so is the Tor web browser, so this is a free private way to send files. Disclaimer, this, this video, video is for educational, educational purposes, purposes only. I do not condone any, any illegal, illegal activity. activity. This, this is, is for, for privacy, privacy only. only. First thing you're gonna do is go to the App Store and download the Onion Share app. This is free and should be available both iOS and Android. Once you download the app, you're gonna click on it and you're gonna click on Add Files. In this demo, I'm just gonna pick a PNG file of one of my updated logos that I've been working on lately. Once you pick the file, you're gonna go down to Start Sharing. Give it a minute to start sharing and then it's going to be hosted. Now your link is gonna be different from my link, but you need to share this to the party that you want to send the file to. Once you get that link, you're gonna to need to put it in the Tor web browser or any other browser that supports the dark web. You're not gonna be able to put this in Chrome, so don't even try, it will not work. Now, side note, I'm using a cloud PC. So basically I'm remoting into a computer that's not from my location and I'm doing all the dark web web browsing. This helps me keep my activity private. The only thing the ISP sees locally is that I'm connected to the website that hosts the cloud computer and only the inputs that I put in, not the actual websites I'm going through using the cloud computer. Let me know in the comments if you want me to make a dedicated video to this. In this video, I'm using Shadow PC. So using the Tor web browser, you're gonna put in that link and you're gonna see exactly what you see here. Now you're gonna see the file and a download file button. So basically right now, I am using my phone to host this file on the dark web and I'm now going to download it on a separate computer. Now you can use any device you want, but in this video, I'm using a cloud computer. Again, this is to help hide my dark web activity. Now the rest of this should be pretty familiar to you. You're just gonna to go to your folder where you saved the file and you are able to view it, just like any other download you've ever done. So that's the picture. This is one way you can use the dark web for good. And that's it, it's that easy. Why is this important? Privacy is not just a buzzword anymore. It's about control. Every app on your phone every service you log into is collecting something about you. Sometimes it's harmless, but too often it's used to track, profile, and even sell your data. That's why tools like OnionShare matter. They give you a way to share files directly, privately, and securely without letting some third-party app spy on what you're doing. Let me know what you think about this video in the comment section. Also, let me know if you want me to dive deep into the cloud computer and why it helps with privacy when it comes to hiding your internet traffic from your ISP. All the links and applications that I used in this video, I'll put in the description. If you want to send files securely without using the dark web, you can use things like Proton Drive. That's what I use currently for my Discord community. This is where I share all the files and Bruce custom themes. I'll leave my Proton affiliate link in the description as well, but do me a favor, everyone, and remember, safety is an illusion.